Well, in doing a little troubleshooting on my HP 9825 computer, I've gotten the display to work, get and all the voltages to check out. Um, tape drive seems to work. Can't tell how many tapes, but the keyboard's still intermittent. But I think I found what the problem is. This titanium cap here is um, connected in, this is the keyboard driver circuitry here. So it's connected in the keyboard driver circuitry and it supplies a uh, voltage comes in through here, goes out and goes to this multiple resistors. What I can figure, I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure that's what that is. Because you get voltages off of here, going to the keyboard for the matrix. And it, you can't, I don't know if you can, are going to be able to see this or not. Let's see if I can get it to focus. Mm, can't really get it to focus. There we go. And it looks like there's some electrolytic coming out. And when I go to do a resistance reading on it, it just completely freaks out. There is, it's all over the place. The meter can't find a resistance. Yet, if I clip to a similar small capacitor, such as that, it immediately goes and gives me a value. So I'm going to have to figure out what value this cap is, if I have a replacement cap, and what I can do about it. But that's the update for the Hewlett Packard 9825 today. Tonight's update at approximately 12.45 in the morning comes under the heading of double check what you're doing before you put something back together. I had replaced the bad titanium cap on the, uh, the uh, keyboard driver, keyboard display driver board. And uh, when I hooked it back up, I reversed the power connector, which blew a switching transistor. Luckily, after some searching on the internet and some happenstance, I found that I have quite a few of them. I've just replaced it. And I'm going to try turning it on. Well, no pop, but that's definitely not right. Crap. Oh well, back to the drawing board.